Prince is about Hawk and he got shot with a slingshot and they broke his mm. wing. So yeah, so uh, we were able to save the wind, but he cannot fly. We just got to Costa Rica. How do you feel, guys? Yeah. Kishan, how do you feel? Feel good. Yeah. Tired. Yeah. Tired? Yeah. When do you guys wake up? Uh, I woke I up at like 2 a.m. I, I didn't go to sleep. I he didn't go to sleep. He was very excited. <laughs> okay. Now we're here. We're going to go through immigration. What's up, guys? Okay, we just came. We used an Uber to get to a Colby store, which is the... Um, internet company so we're getting our data and now I'm with Kishin. Kishin, so what plan are we doing? You don't know. Somehow we, um, I don't know how, but we kind of spoke in Spanglish, so Spanish and English with the person and he understood us. I don't know if he's like bullshitting us, but he understood us, so I think that's really good. Um, Brendan here, he's been a little tired, but he's going to keep his energy up for us. Uh, so we're getting three sims and we're getting three sims and we're getting six gigabyte each. Um, I know that, so just in case, so that's like just in case when we're out we want to use it for emergency or whatever, we can use that. Um, but once we're in the house, I don't think, we can just use the Wi-Fi. But that's what we're doing right now. What's up guys, first day, yesterday we were so tired, we just slept and now we're in the center of San Jose, Costa Rica and we're just walking around El Barrio de Chino, which is um, like the Chinatown here. And so far there's not that much here, it's just like a long streetway. Hola. Hola. Oh, this is a good shot. Keep moving, keep going. Hey guys, we're at the... Um, the some kind of cathedral. It's the biggest one in San Jose. Um, and this is the, our view. It's really nice. Um, it's very different from like when I went to Mexico and everything. Well, let's see. Okay, so Kishin, what do you like? What do you like about this place? That stairs, the staircase right there. Staircase with the platform. I mean, it's huge. And what like um, stands out to you, Brendan? The stained glass one, please. Okay, so we're in downtown. Uh, we're in the main street of San Jose. It has a lot of restaurants, um, a lot of shopping places. Please, uh, a lot of people walking, just walking around. Um, there's not a lot of people today because Costa Rica is playing in Switzerland in the World Cup. So everyone's gonna watch that at 12 p.m. Um, it's really nice. Oh, yeah. And what is that? 
Chicken empanada. Chicken empanada. Do you like it? Yeah, it's good. Kishan, how, how, do you, how do you like it? It's pretty good. I think Brenna got more meat than me though. Oh. 10 out of 10? Keishin, where where are we at? We're going to the Toucan Rescue. Is it, where, where, what's it called? <laughs> Toucan, Toucan Rescue Ranch. Ranch. And do you guys know what this place is? It's a ranch. It's a ranch. It's a ranch. Um, two cans. <laughs> they have two cans. They have sloths. They have everything. They have butterflies. Everything um, that are rescued from the forest, um, treated, uh, f like fed, and after that, once they're well taken care of. They're going to be freed and released into the wild. And this is the road to the ranch. in Costa Rica, we have Hoffman two toes and then we have brown throated three toed sloth. Um, two weeks. Uh, normally, usually it's like one week a week, but uh, if they wait that much, a lot of time, they can even lose up 30% of the weight in just one boat. Yes, it's a big one. And she died and he was still alive. And that we have him since he was a baby, so we have been raising him. But um, I don't think he's gonna be able to be released. But he's a good slot ambassador, so that way you can see how he looks like. Uh, you can see they have really, really big teeth. I'm being so slow, sorry. They have really big teeth. Uh, actually, bites are on the core area. So they probably have a really impressive six pack <laughs> on their other fur. Uh, he can hunt bats, swifts, and so on, so they will hit them, and when they're going down, he will bite and grab them. He's really agile, not as fast as the peregrines, but he's really agile. And then the roadside hawk down there is a really common species of hawk here in Costa Rica. He doesn't have a specific diet, he will eat the snakes, he will eat lizards, he will eat other birds, so um, a lot of different stuff. These two are missing a wing. Prince is about hawk. And he got shot with a slingshot, and they broke his wing. So yeah, so uh, we were able to save the wind, but he cannot fly. Yeah. <laughs> so he is really big. He's impressive, actually. One of 
think he might be in the top five bigger species of hawks we have in Costa Rica. Landing on turkas, we're gonna see more of them, so don't worry about the pictures. You're gonna see them in different enclosures that we'll be able to take more pictures of them. Uh, these two have a sad story. They are actually missing a feet, a foot each. Oh. So what happened with the other one? He was a pet, and someone tied him from his foot to some place, and that started making the injury. Uh, when he was brought in, we have to amputate. Uh, another reason we know he was a pet is because the black spot on his beak, that is bad nutrition. Mm. People will tend to have two kinds of pets. Hey guys, we're at um, El Volcan Irazu. How, how do you feel right now? Cold. I'm cold, that's about it. It's really cold, it's really excited. <laughs> it's probably around like 50 degrees, you say? I don't know, I can't even tell you. 50 degrees, and we're walking, um, we're just starting, the bus just came, and now we're walking to the volcano. We're just luck, let's see what this place has to offer. Yeah, volcanic dirt. Oh, fuck, I hurt my knee. Oh, look, sorry. Oh, shit. Yeah. Hey, it's cold as hell. I did not think hell was this cold, but we're here. Uh, volcanic volcano, El Volcan Irazu. so high that we're in up the, up the clouds uh, it's so foggy it's around 48 degrees I checked um, people said there's animals here that we can feed and then in the middle here it's kind of like a Swamp. Oh, 
volcanic sand.